I really love teaching at FSU and doing research here. The combination of a research culture that allowed me to be both a performer and a, a historian. I was already looking for an R1 that was a public uh, university, so um, FSU fit really well with that. Um, it was in a nice sunny location. For me, it was about having resources to be a better teacher. FSU has amazing resources. My favorite part about teaching at FSU are our students. Um, they are engaged and passionate and eager to learn, and so it makes my job even more enriching. I really like the students here. The students are my favorite part. They're the most well-mannered students I've ever met. Very engaged students and working with wonderful faculty. Um, the, the combination of both and being on a campus that has the resources to uh, bring about great research and to be in a supportive environment for all of that. There are world-class scholars in my field of reading education right here at FSU. And uh, to me, that's very exciting to be a part of that. One of the tips I have for a new professor coming to FSU is to be patient with yourself and allow yourself time to transition. Foster relationships with a lot of different uh, faculty in your department, like going to lunch with people and stuff like that. Uh, and uh, also meet friends. I met some of my uh, greatest friends that I went through the tenure process with actually during the new faculty orientation. Work-life balance is really important. And so that was one of the things I struggled with here because when you come in, you're so excited and you're gung-ho about getting started with jumping right in and getting to work. But you need work-life balance. To be involved in a large university life, that's made a huge difference to me, to be involved with areas like international programs, liberal studies. Frankly, much more interesting because you just get to meet a lot more people who are um, scholars in their own field. One of my favorite ways to spend a Saturday in Tallahassee is with my three-year-old son doing something fun out in Tallahassee. There are so many things for families here. Favorite way to spend a Saturday in Tallahassee, I go to the farmer's market in the morning, um, and then I go straight to yoga. Downtown has a farmer's market on most Saturdays, and so I like to walk over there and kind of uh, with my son and check out what's happening. For me, anything that's, you know, with my spouse and my daughter, whether it's, you know, working on the garden or Doing outdoor stuff really, I guess, is the theme because there's so much opportunity here to do outdoor stuff. Cascades Park is wonderful. My favorite spot on campus is actually this hall right here called Miller Hall because it's like this big sunny area, but people don't use it that much. So since it's right next to my office, I can go in there and use it all the time. What is now the FSU Museum, the Dot Hall, um, I'd say because that has a, a true university feel to it, this, this glorious old building. I love the trees um, in, around campus because the beautiful Spanish moss on the trees. Mm -hmm. I love, love the island. We have a, a beautiful meditation labyrinth on campus, um, and that's a really nice piece of stuff as well. The biggest challenge for me when I came here, at least I was parking, but then I arrived very early because all the lessons begin at 8.30 and uh, I find that there's no issue with parking at all. I would say probably the biggest challenge of working at FSU is working inside when it's beautiful outside. <laughs>